okay. Um, you know, that was one heck of a stretch for us. Um, Memphis, Louisville, and SMU. And I thought we came, um, we finished that with a great effort tonight. And obviously they're top 20 team, top 25. And, um, you know, we just needed to get our offense going a little bit more, make a shot, get a little bit of a run. Um, we just couldn't get that, that little, at least just a mini run, like a 6-0 run or 8-0 run. I'm not talking about a 15, 20-0 run, but something substantial to, um, you know, put them on their heels a little bit. We just couldn't get to that point. But our defense, I thought, was very solid. Um, you know, they got more points in the paint than I would like in the first half, but that's, what, that's how they live. And, but we gave great effort to take things away, especially in the second half. It was a short rotation, and because um, I, I, I just felt that I could trust those those six guys that I uh, rotated in the first in the second half. In the last ten minutes, you played the same five guys. Uh, what was just building on what you said? What was the motivation behind that? Um, you know, it gets to a point where you're just going to play the guys that you really, really trust, um, and guys are going to give great effort guys who are going to give the effort physically, the effort intelligently, and the effort emotionally to stay in the game and do things right. So that's why I stayed with that. Those guys gave me that. And that's the message I'm sending. Coach, can you talk about Malik's play tonight? Um, you know, he's solid. He, he defends multiple positions. Um, he's really a team first, team second guy. And um, you know, again, he was very valuable to us defensively, and he did some nice things offensively. He's just, um, he knows he's an opportunistic kind of scorer, but uh, I like his confidence. His confidence is the key. If he has a confidence, he can do good things for us. Did you go into the game thinking you'd be using those five guys no. defensively? No, I'm, I'm wanting to use every guy. I want our guys to be a part of, you know, growing and coming together. Um, but, you know, you, you, you put the rope out there and, Guys, don't tow the rope the right way. I'm, it's a short rotation. Again, it's, it's trust, it's effort, and guys are going to do exactly what we want to be done. Hey, what do you think of Kadeem's performance, especially in the second half? Again, we know, you know he's, he's uh, an attack player. When he's in attack mode and he can touch the ball, he's, um, he does good things for us. And again, he does a lot of good things at center. And if he can defend that spot, then he can play. He can get uh, a little bit of a, you know, some minutes at that position. Because uh, now we have our defenders on the wings and Craig Brown and Malik. Um, and, you know, that's, that's a good thing for us. He's closer to the basket. He can take a center off the dribble. Um, you know, if he can get closer to the basket that way, he's usually playing the forward. So he has to slash to the basket most times. But he starts there as a center, and he probably gets a different touches and does good results for us. Eddie, what changed for Kadeem in the second half? He had four points in the first half and 18 in the second. Um, again, like I said, we played Greg at center to start. We had Wally at center, and we rotate the two centers, which you know you would like to do. You like to have size and like to have some beef up there and physicality, and you like to have size and Kadeem as another front court player. So you want that size, and hopefully that works for you. But um, it seemed like our mid-sized guys and Kadeem was better in the second half. So we played him at center more. How much do you need a few days away now to kind of rest and think through this last three games? Well, again, I, you know, that's what we mentioned. It was a heck of a window for us. You know, we have um, SMU, we have Louisville, and we have uh, Memphis. It's a heck of a window. But I thought we closed it out pretty solidly with a great effort and chance to win here against Memphis, who clobbered us down there. You know, we had to have some type of redemption. Um, and the first thing I said, do we belong? You know, I asked, that was the first question in pregame. Do we belong? Yes, we belong. If you give this, if you do this, and if you do this. And we did. We just didn't get that, that little mini run, that little dagger, or that dagger that just get us over the hump. Um, but I thought we closed out pretty good. But we have to take it to UCF, and we have to bring it back home to USF. and. Um, the carrot is still sixth place. Now, can we do it? I think we need help, but we can help ourselves first. Eddie, from the fundamental aspect, what more do you want to see out of your team offensively to you know, get that little bit? Um, you know, we're not known as a three-point shooting team. Miles is probably uh, our most reliable, and he's in a little bit of a funk. 
Um, I think he presses to, a little bit too much. Um, but look, it's just just process. You know, you just got to keep doing it. Got to keep doing it. Keep emphasizing sharing the ball, sharing the game, moving the ball, moving your bodies. What do you see? Um, there's a lot of progress from November to now, and um, hopefully. Um, they get the message tonight that we're going to do, we'll play the guys who I can trust. Two more questions. Coach, um, you guys got to the free throw line one time in the first half. We're much more aggressive in the second half. Did you uh, emphasize that at all at halftime? To the officials or? <laughs> uh, no, I think we were just aggressive, you know, um, and I thought that group did things well. They played hard. When you play hard, you share. Um, you have some intelligence out there, and um, you know you, you just you find yourself good things happen. And we got to the free throw line again. We, you know we missed some layups that we like to have, and missed some free throws. But I like the way we our, our personality was for the last you know 25 minutes. Was, was Jerome not a good matchup for Memphis, or is that part of the message you're talking about? Um, no, I just you know I. I Rather than not comment on that, I just like the way we finished up. Thank you. Okay. Thanks,